Hi, welcome to Sass of Mallory and Sass of Sabrina. This is the channel where we try one new thing a week and post however it has turned out. All in hopes to inspire you to try something of your own or give you some laughs. <laughs> So in today's video, we're going to be doing, um, I'm going to be trying dot art on rocks and Mallory has just been wanting to paint and wanting to paint rocks. So it's like a combination thing that we're doing together. So yeah, we'll see how it all goes. I want to paint a smiley face rock. Mm. This is my dot one. Look, that's a perfect dot one. Do the smile. I'm doing the smile, Molly. I'm doing the smile. I did the smile. Now, now the eyes. The nose. This for dot 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 So dot painting. You have to be a little bit more detailed than what I'm doing, but for the first time I think it's okay. But I do think my picture got lost in translation. I wanted the outline of a leaf and then a tree in the inside. Keep working on it. Water. Does that look like a frog? Yeah. It does? Okay, so I keep trying this dot art. That's supposed to be a frog's face. I'm not sure about that one. Yeah, I need way more practice with this dot painting. Why? That does not look like I wanted it to look. If we put it this way, does it look like a flower? Yeah. More practice is needed. A little bit lost in translation once again. Yeah. I think Q-tips are actually the better tool to use. And literally like dip once and then keep going. Dip, paint, dip, the dot, dip, paint, dip, the dot. No double dipping because then it does nothing. This is how all our rock art turned out. This is Mallory's. This is her happy face, which you, unfortunately you can't really see because she used to previously painted rock and some glitter paint that's not very thick. But it's still cute. She had fun. This is how her dot art turned out. I don't think it's anything in particular. And she saw on Pinterest a cute little rock that had a lava coming out of the top of it and, and it said I lava you so she wanted that unicorn poop and she loves color blue so that's what she came up with these ones are just a three-year-old being a three-year-old I thought it was funny that she painted a pretty rock brown and her masterpiece this is her cute little turtle that she came up with all on her own and she literally put a shell on its back yeah, she did great with that one. He's so cute. Here uh, are how mine turned out. So to recap, that's the one that's supposed to be a tree. There's our T-Rex outline. This is my dot art attempt. I'm going to try it again, but on a flat surface. It's my frog face. We're calling that a flower. Some of these ones Mallory picked. They both like dragonflies. We thought this little house was super cute, so we're gonna have like a little gnome house in our garden. She wanted something for Sass of Mallory and Sass of Sabrina. And she picked this one. Keep your sunny side up. And then the little shark face. I think he's gonna be cute because he can actually like literally stand in the garden. Ta -da! Yeah. So we love painting. Rock art's fun. Daughter needs practice. What did I forget? Paintbrushes? Yep. Yeah. Okay. I can't paint myself. 
Actually, I want to do the dot ones with you. You want to try the dot? Yeah. Okay, here's a couple Q-tips. But I have a couple of those, like, paintbrushes that are made for those. Thanks so much for watching my video. Please subscribe, watch on repeat, like, and share. Sass it up! Don't, 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 don't.